Good evening, everyone, and thank you for being here tonight for KION News at 5. We start tonight with the community's efforts to find any possible victims of sexual abuse at the hands of a former Pacific Grove Unified School District employee. What we know is that Andrew Cho is accused of sexually assaulting a 17-year-old back in 2019. Well, tonight we're learning that Cho had ties to the Pacific Grove Unified School District, as well as the city's recreation department and the county district attorney's office. The school district is speaking out here asking any potential victims to contact investigators. PGUSD sent out a message informing parents about his various roles within the district between the years of 2015 to 2021. Cho was an employee with Pacific Grove Middle and High Schools. He was also a high school tutor and an athletic coach. Um, at this point in time, I don't think there's anything more that could have been in place that would have um, alerted us any sooner. Um, and again, we didn't know until the police informed us. Um, so there was no indication, um, no history, and nothing unexpected um, that has happened previously that would have led us to this conclusion. The district also does a rigorous background check before hiring, so he had no priors. The district attorney's office also says that Cho is no longer an employee with them. He does not have a court date that is scheduled at this time, but he is expected to face a judge on these charges soon. He remains tonight booked into the Monterey County Jail. His bond has been set at over $1.8 million.